Hey, what's up, guys? Spears here, and welcome back to the episode of BeamNG. Uh, we're on a new map today, which is pretty exciting. It's kind of like a uh, a monster truck stadium, yeah, but you could do uh, you could really use anything you wanted on it. I'll tell you what, we're not using the pickup truck. Is that water? This map's so this map's got a pool underneath it. That'd be so scary. Imagine that's my biggest fear right there. Look at that. Imagine if you were stuck down there. There's no way getting out. Look, I. You're stuck down there with like just a tiny bit of like space between the water and the the top, and that's what you can breathe out of. Oh man, <laughs> oh god, I don't like that. What's you guys' biggest fear? I don't. I mean, insects don't really scare me or anything like that, but that like water being stuck in like a box full of water is like. Ugh. I'm sorry. I don't really know when this turned into Doctor Phil, but hey, <laughs> catch me outside. How about that? I fucking wish I was that girl. Let's be real for a second. Um, anyways, well, I was gonna say something important, but now I just can't remember. Oh, yeah, I remember, sorry. Um, I'm sorry this video's kinda late today, but, uh, a transformer blew up outside my house. And no, not Optimus Prime. He didn't- he didn't just park outside my house and go, I'm gonna blow up. No, he didn't do that. That wasn't Optimus. It was it, like a power transformer on, on a wire, or a line, I guess. A bird flew into it. And was like, what? This, this looks shiny. I want to touch it. It, it sounded like a bunch of TNT going off. Ow. Wow, that was a lot of... Oh, my God. Or like, I've never heard TNT go off. It sounded like a shotgun. That's what it sounded like. And it was right outside my window. I was like, okay, well, this is it. This is where I die. You never hear gunshots in Canada. Ever. Not once. I've never heard a gunshot. Other than, like, at a gun range. Um, some people watch this video right now are like, man, I can barely hear you talk over all the gunshots. That's weird, man. <laughs> yeah, well, hey, that's cool, man. I'm proud of you. So yeah, like I said, this is kind of like a, um, uh, monster truck sort of map type of thing. Not really, but kind of. You know what I mean? Maybe a little bit. Sometimes, not really. I don't know. But we've got a mod to check out after this one that starts with, a uh, wahoo, and ends with a, ah! You can probably tell by the title, actually, never mind. I'm trying to hide it, but I don't know why I bother. Wow, that was a great paneling. But has that ever happened to you guys? You ever had a transformer blow up outside your house? Or, like, near you at all? It's a really scary sound, because you can kind of hear the electricity, like, crackle out of it. It's like, it's like, and then, or maybe that was just the crow frying itself. I don't fucking know. Look at the backflip, though. Oh, yeah, I lose everything. That's great. I popped a wheel, too. Uh-huh. I like how to, out of everything that happened right there, it was like, yeah, you popped your right front. Wow, that looks not popped anymore. Oh, this thing's got run flats in it. You guys know what run flats are? Yeah, me neither. I don't know. That's just when your wheel pops, it fills itself back up, I guess. But my, the transformer did blow up, and I did lose power, but I still had Wi-Fi. So, are we living in, like, the golden age? Like, what is this? What is this wizardry? I think my, uh, my Wi-Fi thing, like, charges, though, throughout the day, so... It'll run off a battery for a couple hours, and then just... Oh! And then just go... Kaput. You know? So if you had an iPad and the power went out, you could just watch, you know, Netflix. And everything would be fine. I mean, until your iPad died, but... Hey! Backflip! Oh. <laughs> Breakfast! I wanna make that jump. What do I need to make that jump and actually survive? I've got an idea, hold on. Wait a second. Guys, wait a second. Okay, don't go- are you- don't go anywhere. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. Wait a second. It's like, where am I going, Spears? I'm still watching the video. Yeah, you, you dingus. You guys knew this was coming. You knew it. I mean, this this thing will this thing will hit that jump, land, and be like, all right, let's let's hit another one, dude. No one get, get me to do another one, dude. Oh, here we go. Radiator damaged. Well, well, mm, okay. I was gonna say land it, but it's all good. We're we're all roll caged up, looking like a lobster and shit. Anyways, let me uh let me spawn what I wanted to spawn here. Now. Before I do, it's it's a work in progress. This is like an alpha alpha. The brakes don't really work, but the model's kind of there. The only trouble is finding it. That's uh, literally the hardest part of making a BeamNG video is trying to find the mods that you download. Because this is not, um, oh, oh shit. That's awkward. Uh, oh, great. If you're wondering, uh, this is the map's name right here, ATE Stadium. I gotta uh, reload the map real quick. Look at that. It's a Mario Kart. It's definitely from one of the new newer Mario Kart games though, I think. Um but yeah, it's it's not done yet like I said. You can kind of you can kind of tell the seat looks like poop, but the whole model's kind of there. And you know, if you try and brake, look look at the brake right there. See? You push it down. The brakes don't really work, but I'm sorry. Before we we continue here, uh what's going on there though? Huh? What is that? Oh, are these are these the guys that made the map? All right, but I'm feeling pretty wahoo about this this mod. <laughs> Whoa! I hate that sound. <gasps> Damn, it actually jumps. It doesn't wreck yet though. 
Like, this dude literally just released this and was like, everybody's telling me to release this. So here it is. Not even done. Don't complain about it. I'm not complaining, man. Oh, I'm complaining. This That popped. I don't like that. I'm just kidding. Too, too bad he couldn't model it with, like, the um, the shit circling around it, like whatever um, power-ups you get, you know what I mean? You just have that all, all the time spinning around you, so anytime you actually move, you know, like drive forward, they start spinning, but if you sit still, they sit still. That'd be funny. You wouldn't really be able to crash the thing, though, because it has a barrier around it. It, it would have an invisible barrier. I like this, though. It, it just kind of, I don't know, bringing two games together. Hopefully fucking Nintendo doesn't shit on this guy for making this mod, like, hmm. You did what? I wonder if you can change the color of it, actually. Um, because the white isn't really Mario Kart-y. That's, that's kind of what it's missing, I think. Um, so let's see if I can, I can make it like a red, maybe? Oh, would you look at, would you look at that? Okay, we're on a, we're on a different map right now because I, I kind of want to see what this thing acts like when you crash into a wall or you run into it with something that's fast and weighs a lot. <clears throat> the APC. Or me. I'm fast and I weigh a lot. <laughs> I'm fucking big boned, okay? I'm just kidding. I like pizza. Pizza's good. I'm not fat, but I am fat. Pizza. I actually really don't like pizza that much. I don't know why I said that. Okay, so we're gonna park this bad boy down here, and I'm gonna run into it and probably blow my game up. I'm just guessing. I don't know. I'm I'm not 100%, but normally when you have, like, eh, maybe we don't use the APC. Maybe. Yeah, well, yeah, I don't know. Normally when you have, like, a new mod that's, you know, the models aren't really done on, and, um, shit like that, it, it, it it kind of transmogrifies your game a little bit. So like when you crash into it, you guys have seen it before where like there's just bits and pieces that start like stretching. They stretch out. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing that's probably what's going to happen here. It might not though. Maybe I'm just being cynical. Who knows? Here we go! Let's see if I can, <laughs> I can actually keep this thing straight real quick. Please. Yes. Ah! It didn't do it! Oh yeah, it's doing it. Look at that. What's, what's, what is that? Was that the steering wheel? The steering wheel? That looked like a fucking... Alright, well, that was weird. That looked odd. Oh, great, so everything spawned back here. Who'd win in a drag race? I'm just kidding. Like, look at this thing, watch how it accelerates. You could run faster than that. You could, you could run faster from 0 to 60 than this thing will go 0 to 60. I guarantee you, you could. Because I don't even think it's, this doesn't even go 60, look at that. 55, 56, yep. See what I mean? You could. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm not gonna shit on it. It's like I said. It's not. It's not done. Not even close to done. But I'm gonna drive into it again because I want to. I want to squish it. But I want to do it in slow motion this time, so I can actually see what happens. I don't think anything happens. It kind of just takes the blow, and it's like okay, and just yeah, goes about its business. Whatever. Here we go. That's actually perfect, dude. That was amazing. It, <laughs> but there, that's what I'm talking about right there. Oh, it's gone. No, that thing right there. That that creature from the. The Dark Abyss. It looks like it's from some fucking scary movie. You see that? That's what I'm talking about. Oh my god. Motherfucker bent. I bent it in half. I didn't even mean to do that. Let's see if I can slow down before I actually go into the water here. Oh my god. What is that? What is that? Alright. What is that called when bikes do that? Like a front... A stally or something like that? When they fucking slam their front brakes on? <laughs> and do like a nose dive? Or a nose wheelie? Maybe it's called a nose wheelie. A, a Neely. <laughs> I don't know. Let's do it. Come on. Okay, I can't do it. Wait, 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 wait. Nolly. No, 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 no. Whatever. I'll go in the water. I don't care. So. Uh, now this. This is where this this belongs. Kind of. Sort of. Not really. Actually. It's a little figure eight. It's literally a tiny figure eight. Like I'm not even. It's not figuratively a figure eight. It's liter. I don't know what the fuck I'm saying. <laughs> yeah. Look at it. It's an eight. That's what I was kind of getting. What the fuck is that over there? That was a little barn. This has to be one of the smallest maps in BeamNG. Like, if this Mario Kart could actually handle- By the way, the cameras are all messed up too. Look at the camera angles. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> Look at that. Well, here we go. This isn't good. Nope. When I was when I was younger- Sorry, when I was a kid. I, it's funny, this reminded me of it. I, I drove by my old house, actually, the other day. That I used to live in when I was like... The fucking... From like, 8 until like, 14. Or something like that. It was a, I was a young boy back then. But uh, I drove by that, and the people did a bunch of work to it. I guess that bought it now, and um, added like a garage and stuff. Anyways, when I lived in that house, I wanted a go kart so badly, like this, just a little Mario go kart to drive around. And uh, even to this day, 
I still want a little go-kart. But it's like, where the fuck are you gonna drive a go-kart? You'd have to build yourself a little figure eight like this. You know, how much does this thing weigh? Holy shit. That's, oh, never mind. I was gonna say, that's kind of heavy, but it's not. Like, what, you'd have, like I said, you'd literally have to build a, um, a figure eight or like a little track for you to drive it on, because you can't drive it on the street. Like, cops will just destroy you unless you have like an R1 motor in your fucking, in your little go-kart. Like, have you guys seen those videos on YouTube? They got the, um, got the, the, the little go-karts with the uh, motorcycle motors in them. Those things are scary as shit. You see them shifting, they're going like 140 miles an hour. It's like, oh great, you're fucking crazy. Now you know what? This doesn't look that bad, actually. This is the, <laughs> it actually looks like it, it fits, sort of. This is the, the honey I shrunk the grid map, map. Um, if you guys never don't get that reference, it's the Honey, I Shrunk the Kids movie. It's a great movie. Oh, okay. Oh, great. Yep. I think I'd sell the Hellcat for a Mario Kart like this, honestly. I think I would. Drive it every day, get pulled over every day. I'd probably be in jail by the end of the summer, just because it's so illegal to drive this on the road, especially where I live. Like, if you live out in the country somewhere, in America or something, in America, you gotta say America, in America, um, let the bald eagles fly and shit, if you live out there in America, um, pretty sure you could... You could probably drive a, a go-kart on the road all the time, honestly. Um, or if you live in the country anywhere, for that matter. Just, just in the middle of the woods, cops don't give a fuck. You know what I mean? They're not gonna, they're not gonna drive all the way out to your house and be like, Hey, you live like 19 hours out of the city in buttfuck nowhere. I'm, you're getting a ticket for driving that go-kart. It's like, why? There's no one here. Like, oh, you're right. That's the dream. But you also get a bunch of fucking hornets, horse flies. I hate bugs, man. I hate them with a passion. Like, I... Not all bugs, but all bugs. Let's be real for a second. Maybe not all of them, but some of them. Most of them, all of them. It's all of them. I hate all the bugs in the world, really. There's there's no bugs that I'm like, ah, oh, those are nice. Except for ladybugs. They're cool. They don't give a fuck, you know? But if you if you love bugs, you crazy, man. You, you crazy. I couldn't do that. I can't. It's the same thing with, like, spiders. I guess a spider is a bug, so never mind. I'm stupid. Same thing with the, uh, with the horses. If you like horse bugs, I'm not a fan of them. I skipped all, all of school, basically. I had, like, 79 missed days one year in school. It's like, yeah, it's time. Oh, I missed the whole year. Now, a lot of you are probably thinking, Spears, man, why aren't you crashing this thing right now? This is BMNG. You should be crashing it, not just driving around. Well, if you're watching the video, you can't. You can't crash it, man. There's nothing to do with it. You just bend it. That's it. Not even crashing, really. Let's see if the if the mud still works. Oh, great! The mud works. The sand works, and I I bet the water still works. I don't know how this guy did this, man. This is weird. <gasps> I wonder if that little oh the cave system doesn't work. I don't think. Maybe it does. Let's go see. Hmm. Holy shit! It is. Is it small though? Yeah, it's small. <laughs> I can't. There's no. I don't think there's any way I'm gonna get down there with any vehicle I have, really, unless it's like a little RC car. Oh shit. Yep. Can't get in there. Let me let me go down this way and boop. There we go. That's fucking that's creepy. That that is extreme. I'm stuck in the wall. How far down does that go? No, oh, really not that far down actually. Is that? Yeah, okay. Holy shit. That's not a, a drop, is it? Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, it's not, I was gonna say. I wish I had the time to make a map like this, or even, like, knew how to make mods in BeamNG. Like, even simple mods, man. That'd be great, because then I'd be self- self-productive. I'd be, you know, I'd just, hey, I wanna make a mod, make a mod, then make a video on it, you know? I have to wait for mods to come out, which kinda sucks, but, hey, that's okay. It just makes- makes me have to improvise with, you know, finding a half-done Mario Kart mod, and putting it on an old map that I made a video on a couple- like, a year ago. Something like that. I've been playing- how long have I been playing BeamNG for, guys? Three and a half years now? Almost four years? This game still hasn't gotten old for some reason. I have no idea why. I'm not like, ugh, I don't want to play this game. It's like, yeah, I like BeamNG. Just casual. What- what game's like that for you? What game can you just be like, yeah, you know what? I'm fine with playing that, even though I've played it for fucking ever. Counter-Strike and this, for me. But, uh, hey, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, feel free to let me know by hitting that like button, or posting a comment, and, uh, oh god. Oh god. There we go. And if you haven't subscribed already, you should do that, man. It's free. And... Ow. And, um, if you hit that little bell down there by the subscribe button, and you turn notifications on, you'll be my best friend and win $100 in Canadian. Which is like $2 American. You don't even want it. 
Really? You don't even want it? I don't have that money anyways. I've got two big V8s, okay? All my money goes to gas. Every cent I own. It's like, oh, gas? Gas money? Yeah, gas. Gas? Uh, you gotta fill up every day? Gas money? Yeah, okay. Uh, that That's the downfall to owning a V8. Or two V8s, for that matter, you know? Hey, maybe you own, like, five V8s and you get it. It sucks, but it's, it's cool. Alright. Talk to you later.